One of the skills that every ball handler should master is the ability to create space with the dribble. In this short video, I'm going to show you some techniques that will help you become a more effective scorer. All of the best scorers use these techniques, such as Dwayne Wade, Kobe Bryant, LeBron James, Brandon Roy, and Allen Iverson. In order to effectively create space, you need to be aggressively going as hard as possible in one direction or the other with the intention of beating the defender off the dribble. You need to get the defender sliding hard to cut you off. Try to get the defender moving hard in the direction that you're going. Once their momentum shifts towards this direction, this is the perfect time to create that space. If the defender doesn't slide in front of you to cut you off, then you've got the defender beat going to the basket and therefore don't need to retreat and create space. When you attack and get a defender's shoulders turned similar to this, they're pretty much at your mercy, whether you keep going or quickly stop and create space. The main thing here is that you attack and attack hard. Go as far as you can off each attacking dribble. Attack and react. If you just step back without getting the defender moving, a good defender that is playing aggressively will be more likely to stay with you. Now, I'm not saying that this is the only time you can be effective in creating space. Sometimes I'll initially freeze a defender and then quickly step back to create space. It all depends on the situation, but the point remains. In order to be effective off the dribble, you need to be able to aggressively attack a defender, get his or her momentum moving in the direction that you're going, and be able to quickly step back and create space. Don't be afraid to make contact with the defender. Be strong and don't let them push you around. And remember, if they don't cut you off as you attack, then you've got the defender beat. Even if you've got the defender beat, but his or her momentum is going hard in the direction that you're attacking, you could have a wide open jumper instead of a heavily contested shot at the rim. In game situations, there's help defense, so you need to be able to quickly analyze the situation. There isn't just one way to do this. Attack and react. Now when you step back to create space, try to create a good amount of space between you and your defender. That means cover some ground as you retreat and do it quick. Don't be taking little small steps unless you already have adequate spacing. After the space is created, you can pull up for a jump shot or initiate a move. If the defender is coming towards you to close the space, you instantly have an advantage in attacking off the dribble. In this short video, I showed you the main techniques that need to be utilized in order to effectively create space off the dribble. There are eight specific dribble moves that can be used to create space, and each of these is detailed in step-by-step -step fashion on Super Moves Volume 1 and Volume 2.